pretty much all rock guitar has been played. Yeah, yeah. I mean, there's. I, I'm we're waiting for the young 17 year old Eddie Van Halen to come along. You know what I mean? Somebody yeah. to bring some new vocabulary. There's some brilliant players, and most of the guys is all the same guys you know and listen to. But you know, so guitar soloing in the last 10 years mm. is kind of as far as new people coming along. There's, there hasn't been very many guys that you just go, wow, who's that guy? Mm. I, I think the ni the 90s were the anti guitar decade. You know. Yeah. And there's some great sounds sonically. I think Tom Rowe is absolutely brilliant, you know, just the way he approaches making the guitar sound anything but a guitar. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's, it's astounding to watch him play. And he's a great guy. But, you know, guys like that, innovators, the innovators. So I'm, I'm, what I'm into now is just trying to learn how to play, you know, a little bit more from the jazz point of view. I mean, when I play with the band and all that stuff, it's a rock band, so it, it stays that way. But, you know, I do an acoustic spot, you know, I just mess around. Mm -hmm. It's kind of improvised every night. I don't really know what I'm going to do. It just kind of happens. And yeah. that's much more of a jazz approach, just thinking wise, not necessarily playing jazz music, yeah. you know, standard bebop stuff and all that. But you, know, you just open up, you know, if somebody throws a chord at you, you know, you don't have to necessarily play that scale. It's, you can have so many more options. And I, all I listen to is like old miles and stuff like that, just trying to open my ears up. Yeah, because you did Coltrane tune, didn't you? Uh, was it Naima? I did that, yeah. Well, you know, I just did this tribute to Coltrane record. Oh, really? Well, a lot of guys, I mean, you know, Eric Johnson's on it, uh, Robin Ford, uh, got some really astounding players, and I did some weird track, you know, it was, it was actually really cool. I like being forced to stretch myself into other areas, you know, I don't consider myself a jazz guitar player in a purist sort of sense, but I mean, I play through changes in my own way, yeah. rather than using, you know, the standard things that you're used to hearing a Bob Opper play, you know, yeah. but I have such respect for the real cats that do that. Yeah, that takes you. You don't learn how to do that in a week, man. No, no. But you like you kind of take in the sort of some ideas. Yeah, but I mean, hanging out with you. Know, yeah, I mean, yeah. I mean, I really want to develop that aspect of my playing so much more, because you know, you know, I'm going to be 47 years old. You know, I, as far as being taken seriously as a rock guitar player, I mean, you kind of got to keep moving on. You know, Keith's still there, isn't he? Well, yeah, but he's Keith. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, I'm not a rock legend. <laughs> <laughs>